the year is 1980. England faced a slender 19-year-old Diego Maradona for the very first time. It's Diego's first appearance at Wembley. For this friendly international, England, skippered by Kevin Keegan, field an experienced side, including Dave Watson from Manchester City. It's his 50th cap. Argentina includes six players from that World Cup winning side of 78. So the challenge by Van Toon on Keegan. It's just a throw, but Kenny Sanson capable of a long one. Watson has come off on the near post. And here is Watson. Keegan! Well, he had to dig it out, rather. But it was enough to worry for you Came from the set-piece, from the throw. Watson making his presence felt, although, in fact, he didn't make the header. Came down to Keegan and knocked it down well with his chest, but just wide of the keeper. And Keegan, meantime, has to pick himself up off the deck. As we were looking at that, he was brought down by Gallego. Watson still up in the area. Woodcock near the penalty spot. Kennedy up as well. Watson at the back. And Fiol doing very well. And I think the last player, outfield player to touch it was Gallego. Well, we can see as we look at it again. Came in fact off Woodcock and it was a fine save. Johnson on the near post or moving a bit away from it. There's Watson! And again spooned away by the goalkeeper. Looked very spectacular. I suspect a number of England goalkeepers would have held that. Good back click. Watson down and punched away. So far without cigarettes. Oh, he's just got one there poised to light up. <laughs> Neil. Oh, that was a bit solid from Passarella. And the referee saw no foul in it. Woodcock has stayed down. And here is Valencia. Clements to meet him. The post finally. Kenny Sanson who got back to clear off the line. And I think justice was done because that did look a very harsh tackle at the other end on Woodcock. Good stuff from Clements who came out. The first block was from Sanson and then Valencia hit the post. Aldine winning his 38th cap tonight. Maradona. It was so easy it was untrue. Barbas. Maradona again. And he's taking them all on! And let's go wide, but what a marvellous example of this man's ability. Picked up pace apparently from nowhere. Look at this turn, looking at the gap between two, away from the lunge of the third, and a flick wide of the goalkeeper and wide of the post. I think it may just have touched the post. Well, now you know that the publicity has not lied. Thompson, Koppel, four players left of him, and Koppel's got a fine cross and a brilliant goal, scored by David Johnson, I think that's the first time an England player has actually got to the dead ball line, what a superb cross, Koppel finding Johnson, who in turn beat Fiol, now look at this, he's got two players to take on here, Look at the angle of the cross, only just the room to get it, and in comes Johnson to head past Fiel. Well, England have had their problems, but now they have the breakthrough, and a very well-made goal too. Woodcock to Johnson. Oh, say! What a difference a goal makes.
A real thump when it was played to him. Maradona. Oh, dear, oh, dear. That really was a question of Watson's timing. Totally beaten by the skill of Maradona. He was hours late. Just look at the challenge. He'd taken it away from him and he was going through and he'd gone with the right leg and caught him with the left. Maradona, three round him, finds Santa Maria, good check out, and Neil let it go, and escaped. Neil obviously unaware that Valencia was behind him. Maradona with three round him, set up Santa Maria, it was a good check round uh, Kenny Sampson, and Neil obviously unaware of the presence of Valencia, but he got back just to smother him. the managers watching this match and so Berzot of Italy and Guy Tice of Belgium here's Woodcock Chalice by Gajego Kennedy and the goalkeeper got a hand to it but Johnson had the easiest of tasks to get his second goal two go to congratulate him Three went to congratulate the man who crossed. The light obviously on the bench. Just look at the quality of this cross here from Kennedy. It really teased the goalkeeper who got a hand and made it a present really for David Johnson for his second goal of the match. Sanson covering with Santa Maria. Maradona, away from two, and that is a penalty, brought down by Sanson. And uh, Sanson turns away with an air of lack of understanding, but he took on three, and Sanson caught his foot, there can be no question about that. And they've only conceded one goal this season. Ray Clements with an eye pass a second. Oh, but there was no way. For the moment that it was struck, the goalkeeper was static. So Passarella brings the world champions back into contention. Just look at it, it curled away to the goalkeeper's left. Last time Argentina came here, for the 74 World Cup, they got a two-all draw. Here's Keegan, who now has Johnson to his left. Blocked by Cherry, and the corner save. A vicious swerving shot that Clements managed to parry. Well, it must have come as such a surprise to him, but he got it away, kept it out. Passarella, Maradona, early for Diaz, 
And the goalkeeper committed, sends them back to cover and succeeds in doing so. And is thanked by his goalkeeper, who obviously did the right thing to come out. Beautiful ball played through from Maradona to Diaz. And look at Samson covering the angle right on the near post. Showed a lot of pace then. Bertels. Took it nicely on the chest. Well, that's his last action and the last action of the match. England came into this match to measure their newfound form under Ron Greenwood against the champions of the world. And they've come out of it with a 3-1 victory and with great credit. Kevin Keegan getting the third goal, which makes him incidentally the eighth highest England scorer since the war.